Seconds and counting. Hi, and welcome to another episode of Mission Control. At the top of the list of things that flat earthers can't comprehend, we find the word level. In conjunction with level, they like to think that the globe is impossible because water finds its own level. For some reason, it has become rather difficult to explain to them that level is not the same as flat. We are always getting the same old show me water sticking to a ball argument. So I got to thinking, maybe, just maybe they lack the ability to imagine water sticking to a ball. In that case, let's have a look. Yeah, I know, it's CGI. But this is water sticking to a ball. Now you have seen it, and now you know what we're talking about when water conforms to the spherical Earth under the laws of physics. This is just the visual aid for flat earthers who can't picture what leveled water looks like. Everything here is pulled towards the center by gravity. Gravity is just as invisible as magnetism, yet both forces are still real in the sense that we can observe, measure and predict them. Now I'm not comparing magnetism with gravity, because I know they're not the same, but they do share the ability to attract something and cause acceleration, despite their invisible nature. If you don't like my CGI version of water sticking to a ball, then here's a real life example. This one was done by Greater Sapien and shows how fluid finds its level with the forces acting on it. This is ferrofluid created by NASA, by the way, conforming to the ball of clay with a magnetic core. So flat earthers, please be done with the same old tiresome arguments. We want something harder to debunk. I believe this was another safe landing for the GLOBE team, so stick around for the next mission.